Hello there. How are you? It's Diane Banks, voice actress, radio personality, and Disney fan like you. And I hope you'll subscribe, click the red button, check my other videos too, over 300, including Disney cat and dog Easter eggs on Dooney and Burke bags. And yeah, it's pretty cool. I didn't even know they had them there. And I found them and I want to share them with you. So check out the vid. We're going to talk about Ratatouille. Very excited. Coming to Disney Magic Kingdoms. Oh, and also um, we'll uh, get to a few of your comments too at the end of the video. So hang around for those. Always love your comments. But um, we're going to hop right to it here with the Chef's Hat Stand from Disney Magic Kingdoms. Uh, just so you know, this is all going to be permanent content for Ratatouille. It starts January 26th, which I believe is a Tuesday. Um, and the deal is it's permanent. That's the good news. The bad news is it, if you're not very far along in the game, it's going to be a while before you get to it because you have to complete Emperor's Groove before you get to Ratatouille. Wah, wah. <laughs> That's the bad part. But actually the good thing, they are going to have all these little, you know, the mini things that they do like striking gold, those little mini events or whatever they call them. Uh, so that you can get at least like the hat stand and some of the um, rides and things, even though you won't be able to get Remy, Colette, and Linguini until you finish Emperor's Groove. Okay, so January 26th, um, they're going to give us all this stuff in the patch notes anyway. You just go up here to that little envelope. But um, okay, so the um, what am I trying to say? Chef's hat stand. There we go. There's our sh close up on that. Um, I believe that is part of the striking gold. I'll check my notes again here as we go on. But um, that is going to be part of the permanent content you can get early. You don't have to wait until you finish Emperor's Groove. Then we've got Gusto's Kitchen Attraction. And just another view of it here. And on here you can see, look how cute Remy looks. And Linguini, hi! Uh, so there they are. What else are we getting? Uh, let's see. We're getting the Ratatouille dish stand. So there's the, the Ratatouille, which I never thought it was the most appetizing dish in the world, but it's really cute in the movie. And by the way, Ratatouille is my very favorite Pixar film. Is it yours or is it your like top five? I'd love to know that in the comments. Uh, but here, too, I just mentioned Striking Gold. Oh, if you were a, a part of the Lady and the Tramp, um, you would know if you played that part, you would remember that cute little stand. I love that. That's one of my favorites. But anyway, back to Striking Gold. This is going to be your trophy. This block of cheese, which is really cute, as part of the rewards for the Striking Gold event. That's cool. Uh, what else? We're going to move on to, and I will give you the characters to see too, I promise. This is the Parade Float. I think this is actually one of the cutest things that they made for this particular event. Hi, Remy. <laughs> but here, he's flipping through the cookbook. It's like the cutest thing ever. There's the Ratatouille dish. I love all the detail. It's so cute. It's one of my favorites because of the way he's flipping through the cookbook. I didn't really show it to you that well here, but... Um, I tried. Oh, there he is. Yeah, I tried to get you one where he's turning the page at least. Look at how cute. It's so cute. Wait till you see it in your game. You're going to flip. Um, and there he is. Flip like he's flipping through the pages. There he is here. I wanted to show you this too while we're here. Um, you know how we're, I was talking about like the patch notes and things that you get here, you know, the information they have for us when you click on the envelope? Well, now they're adding this little gem, which I think is a really good idea. You click on the gem and it takes you to da -da, the cinema. So no matter where you are in the game, it'll take you back to the theater so you can see if you've got any ads to watch. We all know that the ads are great because you get free gems. You get like two a day. So I just thought I'd give you a little heads up on that. So look for that. Once you get the download next week, um, you click on the little gem there and it'll take you over to the cinema to see if you've got any ads, no matter where you are in the game. I really like that. Uh, the Ratatouille Adventure Ride. How cute is this? We're going to get this and little the little rat car goes around. It's really cute. Uh, there it is. Ratatouille Adventure. And I think I've got some notes for you on that. Yeah. The Ratatouille Adventure is available through 
a leaderboard event that's going to happen on February 4th. Okay, so look for that. And, and like I said, since we can't have the characters right away, especially if you're not close to Emperor's Groove, at least you can get some of these rides and things to give you the flavor of Ratatouille while you wait. So February 4th, leaderboard event, that's how you can get the Ratatouille Adventure ride. Which, by the way, how are you feeling about that? Are you excited that it's going to be at the French Pavilion in Epcot this year? Um, I'm trying to remember what was there before. But um, let me know your thoughts on that, too. And here, this is really cute. They gave us some concept art from the Ratatouille Adventure for the Disney Magic Kingdom game. And you can see that they modeled it after the ride that's coming to Epcot, which is all already, of course, in Paris, Disneyland Paris. But um, I like this, too. Restaurant lights, track arrow lights. So we've got all these lights here. Sign moving lights. There's those. Rat cart moving. And it says the rat trap will be activated when the cart passes by. So there's all the animation. Really cute. And and a, a, another little tip here, if you want to join their email list, if you're already on it, if you're not, the Disney Magic Kingdom email list, you can get that at their website, DisneyMagicKingdoms.com. Um, if you get on the email list, they're going to be sending us more concept art. I've only got this one piece to show you today. But they're going to email us more concept art. So get on the email list and you'll get that in your mailbox. Um, all right, so here's our three characters. One of the things I'm excited about with our new little friends, hi Remy, is that Remy's going to be first out of the gate. Usually the character you want the most, the star of the show, you have to work till the end, like with Brave and Merida. Uh, but this time out, they're giving us Remy first, which I think is great. I'm all on that. Um, and there's our uh, Colette and Linguini. But look at how cute Remy. Um, oh, yeah. And here's just another little image of them. So you can see them. You know, you'll see them better, of course, in the game. But I just want to give you a little sneak peek without having to watch an hour long. Um, you know, the uh, what do you call it? They do the video that they do. You know what I'm talking about over Facebook. The live stream. Thank you. <laughs> uh, okay, so here's Colette and here's her level up. She, by the way, is going to be a premium character. So she's 500 gems. I know we always wish they were more affordable, but she'll be 500 gems if you want to add her to the kingdom. But the good news is, again, this is permanent, so you don't have to worry like, oh my gosh, I won't have her by the end of the event. It's not an event. It's permanent, so you can take your time to get your 500 gems. And I thought this was really cute because she has a little whisk and she's like beating eggs or something as she walks in to do her level up. Very cute. Linguini is doing a little sweep up, which is really cute. I always like to use Pigeon Toad in that too. Cute bit of animation. And then the star of the show, Remy in his level up, he comes in with his little spoon, wanders in. Um, and he's so tiny that it's hard to get a good shot of him. But... Um, there he is. He's super cute, isn't he? Yeah, here's... <laughs> I know. It's like looking at this, um, the other stuff. It's like, I, I wish he was as big as that image I showed you when we started the video. Um, so just a couple other quick notes here. Um, the, the hub, the, you know, where they give us all our patch notes and everything, They've made a new hub for striking gold. We didn't have a hub for this before, which is really good for the, oh, they call these the tapper events. I couldn't think of that. But when we do the striking gold, ta-da, now they're going to have this for us, which is really nice. Because you know how every time you have one of these events, it's like you can't figure out which character you need and if they're busy and what the, what the task is, right? So now we're going to have this, the new hub for striking gold. Find gold trophies hidden throughout, so it tells you Alice needs the curious thing, sitting on a mushroom, I'm looking around, you get the idea. So you know that, um, you know, which character needs to do what. So you don't have to worry, is my character busy, I don't know what they are, or miss out because you don't know what they're supposed to be doing. Here, you know, and this is showing you all the different characters that you're going to need for striking gold this time to get that block of cheese. And the, the tea party, and Mickey, and Alice, and so on. So I just wanted to share that with you because I thought that was 
a good neat addition but like they said on the 26th check out the notes right here if you're new to the game this is where you go up here where the envelope is and it'll tell you everything you need to know about what's coming up in the game all those little um, mini events to get some of these attractions um, and then of course the permanent characters will come in after you finish Emperor's Groove but at least you can get started on the other stuff um, and I just want to before we wrap up see if I, I had written down some notes for you I just want to make sure I got to everything the dish stand flipping through the cookbook um, the cinema I told you about that uh, the leaderboard event on February 4th so you can get this wonderful attraction don't forget to get on the email list if you want more concept art there's our little Remy doodle <laughs> looking all cute are you gonna get Col Colette? I don't know if I'm gonna spend the 500 gems I don't have that many they're precious so I might wait on that since she's permanent and we can get it later I might save it for the next event or something I don't know I gotta think about that one if it was Remy yeah I'd spend the 500 <laughs> But let me know what your thoughts are on that if you're going to spend the gems. Um, but yeah, I think I, I think I gave you all the, the patch notes, as they say, for now. Let's take a quick peek at your comments before we wrap up here. Uh, Randall. Yes, Randall. How cute. From uh, Monsters, Inc. and Monsters University says, Who knew? when watching my video about Disney Pixar and Monsters University Easter eggs. I hope you'll go watch that too. Look for the boys and the Monsters University logo. Randall, thanks for that comment. Glad you watched. I appreciate it as always. Uh, Alexander Lee says, awesome video. Alexander is talking about my video, Disney Character's Best Moments from Hurricane Irma. Look for Chip and Dale with a little hula hoop on their nose. Thank you so much for that. I'm glad you enjoyed. And then Diego Umberto Martinez Alpuche. I don't know if I said that part right, but um, thanks for watching my video, Disney Pixar Souls Concept Art. That's one of the most recent I did because Soul was just released. And Diego Umberto Martinez says, that's a bunch of baby souls. These little cuties right here. So I hope you guys will go watch my video about the concept art for Soul as well as these other videos that these kind folks left their comments on. And please leave your comments. Are you excited about Ratatouille? Are you glad it's permanent? Will you spend your gems on Colette? Uh, and anything else you want to talk about about Remy or uh, Ratatouille or anything about Disney. Um, always fun to read your comments. Please subscribe. I always appreciate you guys uh, subscribing, growing the channel, and uh, take care. Stay safe. We'll talk soon. It's Diane Banks. Have a good one.